A field of nine, Hamiltonian Hull acting a bit green behind the gate, gaps it slightly, now catching up as they head toward the start. And they're off. America's Promise gets the first call from the outside. Cigar Bar toward the inside trots out well. Experience Victory got away smoothly at the rail. And Victory Abroad is up close. He's racing third on the outside. Maximum speed is fifth. Brooke Nichols backs off LeBexter in sixth. Mr. Commissioner is on hurried, as is Cobal. And Liberman Hanover ninth and last, looking to settle in at the tail of the field. So Campbell and America's Promise have easily cleared the field. Cigar Bar is racing in second, opening quarter up in a modest 28 and 2. Burnt Lindstead moves Cigar Bar from second, now challenging for the front. Victory Abroad is third, and Lachance has clear road for experience victory. He's fourth, now moving up into third on the outside as Cigar Bar clears the lead. And now experience victory is coming smoothly up on the outside. He's second and going after Cigar Bar. Racing in third is America's Promise. Then it's two lengths to Victory Abroad. LaVexter underway on the outside fifth. A rail ride for Max Maximum speed six, the half and 57 and two. Mr. Commissioner following LeVexter's live cover. Maximum speed has gone off stride. Cobal finds himself third over. Liverman Hanover is fourth over. And with three eights to go, it's experience victory. And he's two lengths in front now. LeVexter grinding into it up on the outside into second. Cigar bar is gapped in the pocket in third. And tracking cover, Mr. Commissioner in a good striking spot. Cobal is following him on the outside three quarters in 126 and two, and they come to the top of the stretch here. It's Experience Victory who's on the lead. He's two lengths in front. Mr. Commissioner tips off cover. He's closing in steadily on the outside. LeVexter third. Cigar Bar up the rail, and Mr. Commissioner has trotted over everyone to take the lead. Cigar Bar fitting through on the inside into second. LeVexter up toward the outside, and Mr. Commissioner gets pacey again. Cigar Bar comes through on the inside to win it in one fifty-five and one. Lindy Lane Colt out of Martine Lobel by Joie de Vie, owned by the Arden Homestead Stables and Thomas Burtmark of New York and Sweden, trained by Jan Johnson with Bert Lindstead in the sulky. Unofficially second, number six, Mr. Commissioner. However, he is the subject of the judge's inquiry for possible violation of the breaking rule. Third, number two, experience victory. And fourth, number one, victory abroad inquiry on number six, Mr. Commissioner. The Arden Homestead Stable with a long history of top Hamiltonian trotters may have another starter here in Cigar Bar, winning tonight in 155 and one, second win of the season and a career best effort for Cigar Bar. $172.20. The 11th race kicks off the late double, also Exacta and